Hey everyone, here we are back with another Lazy Man Money Method at Sardinia, this one in the Jaguar XJR9. First let's take a look at the setup for this race to meet the 800pp requirements. Suspension and differential are what I personally set them to. You can set them to your own preference, the main change needed is the ECU and performance. And be sure to purchase the high RPM supercharger. Okay, to start set your TC to what you're comfortable driving in, I have mine set to 5 to avoid spinning out exiting turns, fuel map to 4 and make sure you're in automatic. For anyone new to the channel and my lazy man money methods, this is for players that don't want to worry about gears and just want to drive to the finish and collect your credits. So if you don't mind spending a couple extra minutes while grinding then this is the method for you. You only have to worry about avoiding the AI and hitting your braking points. At this section, try to left off the gas around the end of this barrier so you can make the next couple turns on a good line and good speed. And here on the last corner, I let off the gas so I don't end up on the grass or hitting the barrier. Fourth going into the fifth you'll take the lead if you're on hard difficulty, and sooner if you're on normal or easy. End of the eighth is the normal pit time, rear tires will be done by now, but will not affect you and you may need to coast a little during this lap just to have enough fuel to make it to the pit. And if you find this video helpful, please like, comment, share and subscribe to the channel. Your support is greatly appreciated, one simple click for you is a big deal for the channel, thank you. And from here on, it's basically a sprint to the finish while avoiding the AI, so we'll jump to the end and see how fast this was done. Coming up to the line here and finishing with a time of 24.37, a pretty decent time for the lazy man method and another car to add to the lineup if you want to grind with a different car. I hope this helps you stack those credits and I'll see you next time.